Hey guys, welcome back to this channel. Today let's do a battery charging speed test in between these two OnePlus flagships. On my left hand I have the all new OnePlus 70 Pro featuring a 4085mAh lithium polymer battery which is just 2.1% bigger than its predecessor OnePlus 7 Pro I have on my right hand. The battery size is 4000mAh lithium polymer so there is not much improvement in the battery department except for the CPU there is basically uh, no difference in between these two smartphones. Now OnePlus provides warp charge 30 adapter for the OnePlus 7 Pro which is rated 30 watt and with the OnePlus 70 Pro OnePlus somewhat upgraded the adapter to warp charge 30T which is also rated 30 watt 5 volt 6 ampere maximum output 5 volt 2 ampere at higher battery levels and OnePlus claims that this new adapter can charge your OnePlus 70 Pro to 68% in just 30 minutes. It's about 23% faster compared to the older warp charge 30. Let's see in real life scenario how accurate are the claims. Both smartphones here are at 0% battery level that is switched off. Let's connect the respective chargers, start the stopwatch and switch on the power supply. I will take battery readings at 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 45, 1 hour and till the full charge. As you know, I already did a battery charging speed test including the Note 10 Plus which beats the 7 Pro. Let's see if the 70 Pro can be even faster than the Samsung flagship. So it's 5 minutes already on the stopwatch. OnePlus 70 Pro is at 11% battery level and there you have the older OnePlus 7 Pro at 12% so it's even charging faster than its successor so that's a really very interesting outcome. Now let's quickly turn on the devices because I want to measure the real life charging speed. The data shared by the company is basically in ideal condition so with sim card inserted with the Wi-Fi location on and default settings let's see how fast is the new warp charge 30 the next reading will be taken at the 10 minutes mark hey guys so after 10 minutes of charging oneplus 70 pro is at 22 percent battery level and oneplus 7 pro charged to 23 percent so it's still ahead of the 70 pro so looks like the new adapter is not 23% faster, it's even slower than the older one at least till 10 minutes. There is no overheating I think so that's great. The next reading will be taken after 5 minutes. Hey guys, now let's quickly check the battery levels at 15 minutes. There you have 33% battery on the 7T Pro and also 33% battery on the OnePlus 7 Pro. Looks like 7T Pro is catching up. Let's wait for 5 more minutes. The next reading will be taken at 20 minutes. Hey guys, I am back. The OnePlus 7T Pro is now at 41% and the 7 Pro is also at 41% battery. So again, same battery levels. Considering the battery of 7T Pro is slightly bigger, the new charger is also charging slightly faster but not much. The next reading will be at 30 minutes on the stopwatch. I am back so let's start with OnePlus 7T Pro which is now at 56%. The battery level on the 7 Pro is 58% so it's back to the leading position. Let me remind you OnePlus claimed that 7T Pro will be charged to 68% in 30 minutes but in reality it's 56% with SIM card inserted and general features turned on. The next reading will be taken at the 45 minutes mark. Stay tuned guys. Friends, it's 45 minutes on the stopwatch and uh, the OnePlus 70 Pro is now at 79%. The 7 Pro is at 80%. So looks like it's gonna win. Let's see what happens till the end. The next reading will be at 1 hour. 
So let's first check the battery status of the OnePlus 70 Pro which is at 96%. That's really great. The OnePlus 7 Pro is at well 91% so it's lagging at higher battery level which is a well known fact of warp charge but looks like the new charger is not that much slowing down so that's a good point. Let's wait till the phone charges to 100%. Guys, the new OnePlus 70 Pro just charged to 100% at 1 hour 5 minutes and 50 seconds. There you have the 7 Pro at 93%. So it's really faster, especially at higher battery level. From my previous test, I can tell you that OnePlus 7 Pro will take 1 hour and 25 minutes to charge to 100%. So that's about 20 minutes more. So really a considerable difference as you can see the 7 Pro is slowing down at higher battery levels whereas the 7T Pro is almost consistent. Now what's most interesting is 65 is about 23.5% less than 85 so what OnePlus claims is basically true. The new Warp Charge 30T is much faster than before and for your information Galaxy Note 10 Plus also took 1 hour and 5 minutes but the battery of the Note 10 Plus is of 4300 mAh much bigger than the 7T Pro. So still the 25W Samsung charger is faster and no need to mention Note 10 Plus also supports the new 45W super fast charging. Now that's all in this video guys, I hope that it was useful, check the description for the battery drain speed test. This is Shukai signing off, have a nice day guys.